Okay, let's all come back uh, again. Listen, everybody, there is no need to send anything right now. You need to just save these files and I'll give you instructions, further instructions later on. Okay, uh, not today, but in the future. Uh, so for now, just do this exercise. Let me just give you around uh, uh, a quick reminder on what's what has to be in your file. So as I said already, a quick brown fox jump over the lazy dog. It's wrong spelled, correct? Uh, uh, I mean, it must be wrong spelled. You will not do anything here. It's the original line. Okay, so there's no formatting. So the exercise gives you an idea or gives you again a review maybe on how to do this formatting. Okay, so the first exercise is more on formatting. Okay, apply the following formatting in the sentence, which is copied sentence one. That means the first one that you copied, not this original. So there must be an original. In the copied sentence, then you apply these two uh, formats, font face, font size. You can see that it's also repeating. For some of you, you might know uh, the advanced way on doing it. Or for example, you already have five lines. You can uh, format all of them to have this because they are just the same. Okay, then on uh, sentence two, copied sentence two, then you just change this. Okay, or uh, sentence three, you now apply this and so on and so forth. So it's just easy. Now, uh, make the word facts italicized, brown. Apply small caps is an effect for the whole sentence of this, uh, only this. Apply small caps effect for the whole sentence. So... Where is okay? So let me share my screen. Okay, so here again, uh, where is the three bond? Okay, so when you highlight the file or double click on the word, sorry, uh, go to font group and then you have dialog box launcher. Now, do not ask me if you're using MacBook. I do not know the answer on how to do this. Okay, you have small caps, all caps, hidden, strike through, double strike through, superscript, subscript, superscript, and subscript is already here. Okay, and your small cups will be there. Okay, when you apply that, okay, so this is now small cups. So, for example, if I type my name, capital, the small will be like capital also, but smaller. That's why it's called small caps. And of course, the double strike through you already saw there. That will be applicable on number eight. Okay, number six, you run a spell check on the whole document and accept all the first suggestions. I think when you go to Microsoft Word in the review, you have a spell, spelling and grammar. Just click that. Okay, uh, I don't have anything, so I will just uh, type the tweet. Remove the font, I uh, mean the strike through. The small caps. Okay, so let's see. 
So I have some mistakes now. I'll delete this. And if I run the spelling and grammar, accept the first suggestion. Okay. Accept, accept, accept. That's it. Still, I have to have a correction there. Okay, so that means, or you press F7, the key F7. And you go here, you must replicate, meaning must be the same, how it is written. So that's why no smoking, you have a double strike through. Uh, you just increase a little bit your font size. The superscript is here. The subscript is here, so it must be used. And this one, by the way, the border. Okay, uh, it will be used also here, whatever border is that. So for example, I uh, highlighted this. Of course, when you go to home tab, you can see on the paragraph, there is the border. I think everybody knows how to do that. Uh, uh, but when you click here, yes, it's correct because I think I already changed this. Okay, but anyway, because of that, Let's see if it will work here. You can see that this is a big one. So you cannot use that in the last paragraph that I asked you to do. You cannot just highlight this and then click outside. Okay, so when you do that, it will look like this. Okay, uh, what I'm trying to say is that, let's remove all this, um, you can actually do that 32. Okay, you can see when you click this, it's highlighting the whole paragraph. Why? You go here and borders and shading. Okay, when you have borders and shading, apply to it's either the text or the paragraph, okay? So for the number 8, it's going to be the text for the 32, the number 32. And for the paragraph, the last one in number 9, it's going to be the whole paragraph. Okay, so that's why again on text, just click box and press OK. Wait. Where's that? Why? Ah, okay. So anyway, that's the idea. Either you apply with the text or the paragraph. And then the rest of the specification or other instruction using the blue colored highlighter, pen highlight, the word Arabian Peninsula. So there is no highlight here, so you have to do that. Okay, but at the same time, you have to follow all this formatting, bold, italicize, uh, underline, and so on. Okay, do not do number 11. Do not share or save in anything on any folder. You can do that by your own, but you do not submit that first to me, okay? I'm not giving you an instruction to submit for now. So, you will be given an instruction when will you submit it, okay? So, is there any question? Okay, I gave you exercise number two. That will be your assignment. I'm going to discuss that next meeting first. And then they, uh, I will not ask you to do that anymore. I will just ask you to correct your files if there are things that needs to be corrected. Okay? Not ask you to do that during our class time. This is your assignment, exercise number two. Once I discuss exercise number two, you make all your necessary corrections or adjustments, then I'll proceed already to exercise three. I will not, again, I will not ask you to do that on that time. So it's your assignment. It's uh, an exercise that you have to do on your own. Okay? Uh, Amna, Mr. sir, Chiu, I uploaded mine you? on OneDrive already. Okay, you can upload, as I said, it's up to you, but do not share it to me yet. I have not given any instructions yet when or where you're going to submit those exercises. Okay, now do you have any more questions?
Okay, if you do not have any question, thank you very much. That's all for today. Have a nice day. You too. Bye. Bye bye bye. Thank you, Mr. Have a nice day. Thank you very much, Tarik, Isra. Everybody, thank you very much.